Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Dear viewers, today I will show how to model sunken slab or drop slab in proto structure. So let's start. Here this is our plan and here this is 3D view. We can see only the floor, the active floor in our 3D view. Go to active window settings, scene settings entity visibility filter here here we can choose active story only okay in 3d double click here then select history this is our level 2 3d view and here level 2 plan see here this is our sunken slab here already this is dropped how to drop this one select this slab properties here you will see this reference level minus 220 millimeter that means 220 millimeter it will go down from the top level of beam If I make it properties 0, then it will go at the top level. Okay, undo this one and redo. Here you see the difference in the bottom of this floor, you will see the beam drop if you don't want to see this beam drop you have to level the slab with the same bottom level of the beam that's why here in regular practice to avoid the drop of beam from bottom view we use sunken slab or drop slab now you see if I make this 220 coming from the beam depth minus slab thickness update ok so now see from bottom you will not see any drop line so that it will look like flat slab from the bottom but here this sunken portion will be filled by sand filling and then plastering and tiles work we can do same thing in other floor for example go to roof floor here if we want to make this one down properties here we will see the depth of hidden beam here if you take the mouse over the beam it will show the summary beam length 5000 millimeter width 600 and depth 400 so this is 400 millimeter depth hidden beam and this one slab 190 that means slab thickness is 190 millimeter here so 190 minus 400 that means it will come 210 so to see the plane level from the bottom we will have to drop this slab minus 210 update okay now see here this side at of this slab and this beam bottom is at same level this is 210 millimeter drop 
this is called drop slab or sunken slab this is regularly used in Europe and Middle East so in this way we can model sunken slab or drop slab easily in prototype structure so thanks for watching stay tuned for more important tutorials press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update